Hi, I'm Marianne Howright with Triangle Area Real Estate. It's almost the first of the year, January 2013, and this is really the time to start thinking about putting your house in the market for the spring. One thing I've noticed is that our spring market really starts in February. Not that many houses are on the market yet, but there are buyers looking. So if you want a competitive advantage, I'd suggest going ahead and getting the house ready now and get it on the market in February. When I'm getting ready to list a house, one of my most important tools is my camera. There's a lot involved in marketing a home, but I think it all starts with the photographs. That's where you have the basis for your house website, for your bro property brochures, any postcards or mailings that you do, for the flyers that are in the box in front of the house, and for the home book that the new buyers and their agents are going to take with them when they leave. It is what buyers look for online when they're deciding what homes they're going to look at. So when you have 50 houses to choose from, you have to make sure that your house shows the best out of all of them. The point of a buyer who's sitting in their living room looking at houses, thinking and fantasizing about what their new home is going to be like. This house is homey and comfortable, but just a little too cluttered. So we cleaned it up, staged it a bit, and got a professional photographer in. Here's another room in the same house. It looked pretty good. It was hardly used. But we noticed with the photos that there was some work to be done, and we did it. The professional photographer came in and added his touches. Here are a few more before and afters. Before and after with the professional photographer. Another of uh, one of my staging shots. And then how it looked after the professional photographer. The room looks larger, cleaner, and brighter. So use your camera as a great another set of eyes, but don't underestimate the value of a professional photographer. I'm Marianne Howe Wright in Chapel Hill, North Carolina.